Returning back to the theme of international travel, not least because there are thousands of people who have worked in this industry over the last two years who have suffered greatly, and I think it would be respectful of this place to focus on them rather than some of the wider issues that have just been brought up. Can I warmly welcome the Secretary of State's announcement today? Over the last two years, I know that he has battled hard to support this sector. These are the last of the barriers to be removed, and I hope that the industry will now be ready for liftoff. Can I ask him specifically, border force resources are absolutely required once capacity does increase into the summer. Can he do everything in his power, working with the Home Secretary, to ensure that we've got everybody at the airports that we need? I used the airport the weekend. They were fantastic. It was really efficient. But as numbers upscale, so must they. Well, I absolutely agree with my honourable friend. Um, border force and making sure the resources are in the right place is going to be very important, particularly as our airports get busier uh, once again. And I will certainly undertake to speak to my right honourable friend, the Home Secretary, about those provisions. It might interest the House to know that on the e gates, not having to sh check a separate database for the passenger locator form, which was being automatically carried out by the e, e gate, both through software but also through hardware, saves up to six. Uh, seconds per passenger coming through and should also help uh, relieve some of the queuing. 